welcome back to another video of course with the end of the spring season animes i think it's appropriate we talk about kaiju number eight one of the best animes of this season now if you haven't seen it let me tell you something it's a great show but let me give you basically the summary of it kaiju number eight is about kafka hibano and his friend leno about him trying to join the defense crew he eats or the a kaiju finds him and forcefully makes kafka ingest him basically turning him into like a human kaiju hybrid it's, uh, it's real cool the designs are cool the action is real nice and the main antagonist of this story as far as i know and as far as i've read up on the web novel is kaiju number nine as he makes and produces a lot of the daifuku dai, dai, the high ranking kaiju that really presents a threat towards towards humanity so he's the main antagonist of the story you'll see a lot of him in season two season three because this will for sure get a season two when it comes out maybe maybe in a year or two probably two three years because it's going to take some time especially if the animation studio is busy but uh the only problem at least my only flaw with the story is that he doesn't struggle early on with his uh with his kaiju form of course we see it now now in the recent episode but with their first five six episodes he's not struggling with his kaiju form there's not a power struggle there's not him and the uh and the kaiju that forced himself in him to really a power struggle like i would have loved to see a power struggle early on and if that turns you off to the show i get it but you should see the show for yourself really cool concept the most you know they were able to show off the most powerful defense force which right now is general shininoya as he's the general in of the the defense force against the kaiju and obviously we'll be introduced to more characters in their prime that are stronger that's in division one two three four of course but yeah, with that saying, I the only thing I do wish is that there is a lot of skipped anime content, and I will make a video about that in a different video. There's a lot of skipped anime content because they want to generate the buzz. They want to generate the action. They don't really, so they skip over a little bit of, as some animes do, but the action scenes are off the chain. The characters that you're introduced to, the the closed off guy that just wants to be cool and wants to successfully do their job their entrance exams is not the best entrance exams as it's just shini moya just going off on her own doing things and kafka hibino basically able to die basically working smarter and not harder but that's just my opinion if i had to rate this anime in the spring anime season compared to the rest of the spring anime it's a cool seven out of ten there's obviously some flaws. The pacing is kind of off, but it has a face for a great first episode. The entrance exam does fall flat, but when Kafka's in his uh, kaiju form, it's it gives one of the best moments, some of the best moments in this season's anime. 